For defendant Victor Rivas, charged with killing 15-year-old Ethan Soto after members of Soto's family jumped over a partition and attacked him in the jury. Said Rivas had gestured towards Soto's family after being brought into court. Good evening, friends. Tonight, Ed Wallace and I are going to be covering a new case. There's no reason why she would just get up and go off and do that. Whatever happened to her, there has to be a reason why. Others plea for her daughter to come home. Tonight, we're learning of new information on the capital murder case of pregnant 18-year-old Savannah Soto and her 22-year-old boyfriend, Matthew Guerra. I don't know where she's at or where she could be at. Soto vanished over the weekend. Relatives say she never showed up at the hospital to be induced to have her baby on staff. The couple was found dead with gunshot wounds inside their Kia Optima car at the northwest side of an apartment complex on Tuesday. The silver vehicle you see is Soto's car. What would the benefit be? Because he's known to frequent that area. So and they I, have one video. And he, right. And, and the car is seen in the area. The video is from the location where 18-year-old Savannah Soto. Chief, you said that Emmy said that for Matthew Guerra, it was a gunshot wound to the head. But when we called them, they said it's a contact gunshot wound. What does that mean? It means that it was there. Um, you're going to get it straightforward. You're going to get it from experience. Ed Wallace, just a, a chock full of information. When we talk about the, the manner of death has not been determined, the manner meaning was it a suicide or was it a murder? So that's what the ME has yet to officially put out. To clarify, you are treating this as a homicide for both people? It is a capital murder investigation. I did see blood in the car when I, when they opened it. The chief also didn't mention a suspect, any type of murder-suicide situation, or if there was a weapon in the car. Tons of evidence um, to document, record, collect, package, and ship off. From the forensic standpoint. We'll see you tonight, 9 p.m. Eastern. Talk soon.